My name is Kaylin, shameless self-promotion Creighton. I also go by K-Cray, and I am your coach of the LA Spice, the spiciest rap team there is. And welcome to week, jazz hands, 10 of the WBE. This week, we are taking on the one, the only, the only coach in this league who is undefeated, Joey Pokiam in the Bronx Bear Ticks. So that's fun. I'm not nervous. I'm nervous. Um, but uh, yeah. As you can see, I am in a different location and the battle is up late, so I apologize. I came to visit for Worlds. I competed in the uh, TCG Open, actually. And um, yeah, and I'm staying with my mom, so this is the setup. That is a picture of me as a baby. That is a fish tank. Um, I made this plate as a child because I was a prodigy. Anyways, um, put that down very carefully. That will be worth money someday. Um, <laughs> I think that that's all I have to say. I'm sorry if anything goes weird. I'm on sort of a makeshift setup right now. Um, but yeah, if you guys have not already, you should totally leave a like and subscribe. And let's go ahead and get into the team builder. All right, so first off, we have Mimikyu, the, 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 the Mimikyu, the B-girl, with Ghostium Z this week. We are running the disguise ability. This is really unique for most Mimikyu sets. Anyway, um, Shadow Claw, Shadow Sneak, Play rough in sword stance. So Ghost DMZ, because Toxapex and because Bronzong, um, although Bronzong probably drops to a Shadow Claw at like plus whatever. But is the problem, the problem is his team is strong. Okay, <laughs> uh, that's the problem. But yeah, Mim I'm sorry. Uh, Mimikyuti, very cute. Up next. Magnezone with Choppleberry, that fighting resist berry, um, for, you know, the things that have fighting type moves. We are Discharge, Flash Cannon, Hidden Power Flying for, uh, mostly the Breloom, but also, uh, potentially Gallade. I think that, <sighs> people are mowing. Anyways, hope you guys don't hear that. Uh, but, like, Discharge and Flash Cannon might do comparable amounts. Anyways. Uh, and then Magnet Rise for uh, Piloswine, Crooked Isle. Um, yeah, I, I think it could be pretty neato if, if that works out. Um, oh, my gosh. Everything is annoying. Anyways. Uh, but, yes. Okay. All right. Morticia, the Crobat. Morticia. Choice Scarfed. This is just sort of, like... Ugh, if anything just gets out of control, his Volcarona, obviously Breloom, Mega Gallade, we are Choice Scarfed, there is nothing that, I think even it, I think, I know that plus one Jolly, we outspeed, plus two, not Jolly, uh, Volcarona, we might outspeed as well. Um, but nothing outspeeds us as is, even if it's Scarfed on, on his team. Um, fully attack invested with Brave Bird, Cross Poison, U-Turn, and Defog. Defog? I don't know why I put that emphasis on defog. Anyways, the cross poison is in case the comfe comes, um, because that thing is scurry. Um, but yes, the other one's for obvious reasons. Uh, defog, obviously we're scarfed, but if we get into a situation where it's like toxic spikes are down and rocks are down and blah, 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 then we can, obviously we're scarfed so we can get defog off before we have to worry about, uh, dying or anything obviously without priority um Kerberos the goodest of girls is coming this week with flamethrower dark force destiny bond and nasty plot the destiny bond is pretty cool because like we haven't run it yet and uh I love Kerberos so much that I I, I would be hard pressed to click that destiny bond but if we're in a situation where it's like mm, if I don't take this thing down now and most through the rest of my team, then Destiny Bond it is. <sighs> yeah, okay. Uh, we are, we have enough speed so that we outspeed his Mega Gallade. Yes. Mother heckin' Starboy uh, is coming this week because he does not switch in to this thing. We decided on Natural Cure over Analytic. The attack boost is nice, but we're also doing chonky damage regardless, and obviously... If we do get poisoned by the Toxapex or something, then the natural cure is nice. Scald, Psychic, Recover, and Thunder Wave. Um, if all Stormy does in this matchup is 
Thunderwave the Mega Gallade, then like, okay, <laughs> you know, I we take those. We are Colberberry in case some sort of knockoff situation happens. Um, yes, and last but not least is Helga the Garchomp with Ruskin Rocky Helmet, Dragon Tail, Earthquake, Toxic, and Stealth Rocks. The Stealth Rocks obviously against Volcarona are huge, and um, yeah. I don't know if, um, I don't know if he brings the Bronzong. He could obviously be heatproof or levitate. Um, that's, so that's a little scary. We aren't bringing Sun this week because he just, he has, one, he has so many good ground types and answers to fire types. Two, uh, there are so many threats on his team that, like, every member of this team is necessary to soft check something. And even then it like, it's still scary. Um, so no sun this week, but uh, the sun will come out. I don't know what week we don't know. I don't, we haven't built that team yet, <laughs> but um, yeah, I say we go ahead and get into the battle. Beside myself, I'm an independent woman. Okay. I will decide the rules. Of course they're mowing outside now. <laughs> they just started. Okay, um... Oh, the Bronzong's coming. Okay, yeah, it makes sense. Uh, uh... Everything else seems as expected. All right. We're gonna go Starmie lead. And then the rest doesn't matter. I don't even have a notebook. I mean, like, I'm sure that... An EpiPen. And now the phone's ringing downstairs. There's a thing outside. I don't have an. Oh, this is a mess. An absolute mess. Whatever. It's fine. Stop mowing! <laughs> <laughs> uh, okay. How much of a sellout am I that I'm wearing <laughs> wearing one of my Bert shirts? What a mess. And then I just disconnected my 3DS. At least it reconnected pretty quickly. He's really thinking about what he's gonna do. I'm just I'm just YOLO in this. I don't care. <laughs> I'm YOLO in this. Um <sighs> Alright. I'm sorry that my background looks so weird, and I'm sorry that there's sounds, and I'm sorry that I don't have a notebook, and I'm sorry that I don't- I'm sure there's plenty of other things that I have to be sorry for. A Johnny? I'm just gonna click Thunder Wave. If he switches out, then he switches out, but... Like, YOLO. That's, that's the name of the game this week, is just YOLO. <laughs> like, if he switches into Pyloswine or Crocodile, whatever. I mean, he could, I guess. Like, expecting the Psychic go into Crocodile. But also, like, it's fine. No, he stayed in! T-Wave? <laughs> oh, I don't know what's happening. Alright. Come on! Fully para! Nom 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 nom! Thank you for doing that. Okay, and I think that I just go for the psychic move next. Yeah. Like, Starmie... Starmie has done its job. <laughs> I... Alright, what's this What's this queen's name? Uh, Galade Mega? Okay. Galade Mega can only... Stop this. 
I'm sorry. This is apparently just going to happen. Can only be me. Me. All right. Yeah, I guess I go. I guess I go psychic. See how chonky he is. That's pretty. We got the full para. This is the only way that I have any chance here. All right, he's pretty chonky because that was. This was, uh, no speed up investment, jolly. So it did, it did a little less. He's got a little investment, if I had to guess. He probably... Crit. No, okay. <coughs> <coughs> we get that, he gets that clean KO, though. Um, Okay. What do we want to go into? Uh, is Crobat pretty free here? But I mean, I feel like it'd be pretty obvious what's the coming. It'll be coming around the mountain when it comes. It'll be coming around the mountain when it comes. Could Kerberos come in? Could, could uh, Gartromp come in? I don't want Kerberos to come in while Bronzong is still hanging out. Let's look at Garchomp. Let's see. Helga. Okay. I mean, I suppose we could go into Garchomp and go for Earthquake. And if he switches into Bronzong, at least, and it, and it doesn't hit it, at least we'll know whether or not it's Levitate or Heatproof, which is pretty valuable information. All right, come on. He has all these funky names. Okay, all right, all right, all right. It's probably... It is Levitate! These are things that we now know. These are things that we know. I should have gone for Stealth Rocks. I'm going to go for a Stealth Rocks now. That was pretty clean. All right. Chunk, 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 chunk. He had an ice move. Oh, uh, we both got our rocks up. I'm just gonna Dragon Tail. Dragon Tail, I know I'll go second because it has negative priority. I know the answer to that now. Alright, I really should have put Rapid Spin on... Uh, Starby's dead. It's fine. She's gone. She's out of here. Wow, you used an earthquake. That's okay. That that doesn't do much. All right, now he's going for HP ice. Whatever. I probably should have switched, but... <laughs> it's time to go! Does he knock out with... I think that he has to go for an ice move, right? Because I could go into Magnezone and Magnet Rise. Expecting the ice shot. I think that that's really all I can do. Because, like, gotcha goes down. And Garchomp is cool to save for, like, a switch in later. I think I gotta go for this. And if I die, and if I die, let me die. All right. All right, we're gonna chonk that. You know what we're gonna do now? We're gonna magnet rice. Okay. We chonk that. Absolute chonker machine. Who are you going into? Back into this? Back into this queen? He could hit us with a fighting move. 
it, it does Mechagallade mm, paralyzed outspeed a Magnezone? No. Literally everything that I could possibly do to this will do the same amount of damage. HP flying will either do less or it will do more. It's so weird because everything is 60.8 to 72%. HP flying is 61.5. Oh wait, that's more. That's a bigger number. I'm gonna... Uh, uh, I don't want to talk about it. Uh, <laughs> Alright, I guess we just flash cannon. Alright. We speedy enough to outspeed it. That was Jolly Max. Even if it was Jolly Max speed, we would have outsped with our with our investment. Um, breakable. He's alive. Dang it. All right. So we have the Champleberry. Let's see. I think I might go for the. I can't switch here. Because then he just quiver dances, right? Volcarona, let's see he let's say he's this. Flamethrower with the berry. We living. We living. I say I go for discharge and hope for a para. Cause it does about the same amount as HP flying. Kaylin, why do you have HP flying? Big brain moves. Big brain moves only. Okay. Fiery dance. Do we? I th we should live this. Come on, do it to him. Oh, a crit! <laughs> okay, he probably goes into pilot swine and just uses his ice move because, like, yeah. Magnezone goes down, but, like, I think that that's a fair trade, you know what I mean? Like, he's using Ice Shard, yeah. Like, we, but we die on Switch Ed next time, so, like, there is no reason to save him. Okay. We go right into Kerberos. I think, is it time? Is it time to click Destiny Bond? Because, let's look at this. I'll trade, because we don't knock him out. I'll, here, what's his name? Pile of Swine. He's a pile of swine. My nickname in middle school. Okay. Like, we don't knock him out. So I just say we Mega Destiny Bond. Like, I think it's time to go. He didn't switch out, so like, I don't care. We take, we take what we can get. Okay. We did it. I don't even know who he has left because I didn't write this nonsense down. Okay, Pile of Swine's done. Oh my gosh, I'm nervous. Oh, uh, okay. So it's what three to three to three right now. Three to three. I say. I say we come out with Crobat. Because worst case scenario, we just U-turn. You know what I mean? Pointed. Pointed stone stuck into Mortisha. Okay. Do I need to defog? Is that important right now? I don't think it's... How much do we do with... Crobat? Mortisha. 
Alicia. I think we stay in here and just... Oh, you, the Pex. Okay. I say we stay in here and just Brave Bird, honestly. Like, I think we just do it to him. Like, okay, don't get a burn, don't get a burn, don't 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 burn. Okay, it didn't burn. All right, we Brave Bird one more time. And I think that that puts him, if he doesn't recover, it puts him in Shadow Sneak range. I mean, we have to Brave Bird because we're scarfed into it, but like. All right, we didn't, it didn't burn. It didn't burn. That's what, that's what we needed. All right, what are we about to? He has all these funky names. That's going to do nothing. Um, Pokemon. Okay. I think that this is the time. He probably goes for HP Ice. I think that Morticia is good enough to save right now. Because, okay, let's look at Garchomp. Who does, I don't, okay, he has Bronzong, Toxapex, and who's his third? Who's the third that he has left? I wish I had a, I wish I had paper. Um, like, Earthquake is pretty good, actually. You know, I actually think that I stay in. I think I stay in because Garchomp, Garchomp with once this thing is gone with Earthquake can do some work. And Mimikyu has uh, the Ghost Z move, so like, I think I just I just stay in. Maybe a crit. <laughs> Use psychic. Okay. Okay, I think I have to go into Mimikyu. I don't. Is his last Mon potentially a normal type? Let's go into Mimikyu. Do I need to get behind a Swords Dance? So he has Psychic, he has Earthquake. I don't know what else he has. Uh, Mimikyu versus a Bron Zong. <sighs> Gyro Bell knocks out. Oh, wait. Back. I think that... Back, you fool. All right. I think that I need to sword stance... Yeah. At plus two attack. And then I just go for, I go for Shadow Claw. I don't think I fire out the Z move now because he still has the thing in, in the back. Okay, please knock out. There we go. Okay. Okay, and I have Garchomp in the back. He has Toxapex and something else that I have no idea what it is. Maybe Tithe Taker? Crook. That's right. This thing could be... Okay, so we're, we're still at plus one. We're going to play rough. It could be Scarfed. Foul play. How much is this going to do? All of it. Okay. <laughs> I maybe should have preserved. No, I don't think that there was a way that that could have been different. Okay, we might, I, I think this might be it. 
Because all we have is the EQ. Yeah, I think he's he's scarfed. All right, well, you know what? <laughs> you know what? N no, no, no. Because if he was scarfed, even the sh like Shadow Sneak, because he's a dark type. All right, you know what? <laughs> I'm kind of, I'm pretty happy with how that went. I got to do some stuff that I wanted to do. <laughs> and like, I didn't have a notebook. I didn't even remember what his last Pokemon was because of uh, the fact that I didn't have a notebook. Um, but like, GG. That was a really fun game. I enjoyed that a lot. Joey, thank you so much for playing. Um, obviously, like, only continued to be the only undefeated person in this league. Uh, GG. Go watch his side of the battle if you haven't already. And um, I do want to give a special thank you to my patrons of the month. Billy, you are amazing. And um, I'm sorry that this is late again. I'm sorry that I'm a mess and, you know, all of that. And uh, also, um, I guess, yeah, I, I, I think that that's all I have to say. So I hope that you guys are having an amazing day. And tune in next time for more shenanigans. Bye!